Or yo, what's going on YouTube? How you doing? Good afternoon. It's me, Vince SGN, and uh, today I'm going on a little bit of a mission. I'm headed out to Best Buy. I want to uh, buy something else for my setup. I was looking at uh, gaming setups this morning. Anybody coming? I was looking at gaming setups this morning on Instagram, and I got inspired by one gaming setup that just looks so freaking cool. Because I really haven't taken any much, like any pride. Oh my god, what are my neighbors doing, bro? If you could just see the amount of stuff they have, but like they're moving out or something. Um, but I was looking at the setup, and just this one piece just really spoke to me. So I am going to do my best to uh, take some pride in my setup now. I'm going right now to, to get a, I don't even know what to call it. I guess it's it's literally classified or called a uh, RGB mouse pad long. It's basically just a mouse pad that's really long and it's got like lights along the side. And I don't know, I just saw a couple setups that had that and it looked cool. There was one setup that I saw, it was like this, this chick setup. It was like all like white and light blue. It looks super dope. She had like white monitors, white uh, PC case. You know, I, I thought it looked really cool. So I'm like, okay, boom, I wanna do something like that. So, so I got like a black theme going on with my stuff. My PC case is black, my monitors are black. So I'm gonna get the, uh, the whatever. And maybe I'll, I'll maybe even see if they got some extra lights to go on the back wall. Cause my back wall behind my piece my monitors looks like super duper bare there's like nothing there um so yeah i don't know we'll see what happens when i get there Let's see how that parking job went. Uh, not gonna wear a mask because who wears a mask anymore? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Who talking about I can't park? Look at that. I'm talking about that's perfect. That's a perfect parking job. All right, let's get it. All right, let's go. All right, so I'm gonna go in here. Got my whole Naruto fit. Well, I feel like a, a dumbass weave right now. You feel me? But it is what it is. I like Naruto, so. Alright, here we go. Uh, excuse me. Yeah. RGB mouse pads? Um, all mouse pads or is it like a gaming mouse pad? Yeah. So those are going to be, you see that bulk stack of TVs by the tablet sign? Yeah. They're gonna be behind that, okay? Alright, cool, thank you. She's cute. She's one of the girls that was here. No, I think she's actually the girl that was there whenever I got my... Oh, fuck, I forgot. I came up here and got something, and she was behind the counter helping somebody that was new. And I was like, damn, she's kind of cute. All right, so here's the tablets. Oh, these tablets look kind of nifty. I've never been a, a big tablet guy. I'd rather just get a whole ass laptop. My mom, she, she, my mom is fucked up about tablets. She loves her Kindles and her, her iPads and all of them. What the hell is this? Hear me, press O. What, what is this? Hi there, I'm Alexa, talking what? to you through an Echo Dot Kids. It's the smart speaker made for wild imaginations. How cool is that? The super fun design delivers the same full sound ah, as a regular That's Echo neat. Dot find the mouse pad. I think I actually I found where I want to go. It's right here. Okay, so these are keyboard C. Now something like this, how it's like I think he's they've got like the light back there. That's cool. Oh word. So here's all their Elgato stuff right here. Oh, now you see, I need one of these. I will get it a bit of a day, but not for 129. Just a nice light in the back of the monitors. Okay, so here we got a stream deck. Well, I still have no idea. Like, I, I get what a stream deck does, 
but I still have zero clue as to how they do what they do. So I guess this is the light, and I guess, I don't know how it would sit under because they just got this thing hanging. How would it sit up there? Maybe there's like another little part. The uh, microphone looks kind of dope though. All right, um, I still have not found the mouse pad. Okay, so these are the mouse, the mice. Boy, don't you know I need one of these? Let me get one soon. Damn, now this is a dope looking PC. I saw a setup where Buddy had it just like this. And it was this, this PC, or at least this PC case, and everything else about it was white. The monitor was white, keyboard was white, desk was white, and it was just really, really cool looking. Boy, you know, I'm not seeing, I'm about to ask somebody, bro. Cause I'm not seeing, uh, unless I'm just blind, cause I'm not seeing it, homie. Let me find somebody and ask him. I'm just not seeing it. Excuse me, sir. Well, I'm looking for the uh, RGB mouse pads. The RGB mouse pads? Yeah. Any particular brand? Uh, not really. Please don't tell me I was right over here looking dead at him. I didn't see him. Uh, no, they're sometimes hidden. Uh, I know of course there we have one back there. That might be the only one we have in stock. No, oh, okay. Let me double check that. Our, our course is the only one I have right now. I'll show you where it's at. Check it out. That one right oh, okay. This thing is huge. Yeah, it's actually large. And this is... That's $40. This is the one I looked at online then. I, it looked a lot slimmer online. <laughs> now, where does it plug in at? USB. Oh, okay, I see it, it's back here. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, yeah, I'll uh, I'll take one. Yeah. All right. Hey, do you guys have any of the light panels that go like on a wall? Yeah. Like triangle ones? Yeah. All right. So you have, this will be all like smart lighting and everything okay. like that. You have like the nano leaves, those are the hexagon ones, there's the triangle ones up there as well. Okay. Uh, there's the smaller triangle ones, you now it's basically on this area. This All right, cool, stuff. thank you. Mm -hmm. Excuse me, they have the, uh, they have this. Uh, All right, so let's see. I'm trying to get like the super big ones that I see people see. Now, are these it? Are these like the, Whoa! They got to be tripping, bro. They want $169 for these bitches, bro. Look, there's the almighty PS5 right there. That thing is a lot heavier than it looks. Look, it's Myth. All he wanted to do was be a, uh, a gaming personality. I gotta admit, though, on the little ads, little walking commercials, he, he, looks, he looks happy. He looks happy. I, I wish all the best for Myth. I couldn't imagine being him right now. I can imagine having his money, but I, I couldn't imagine being him. Like, not, not at all. Oh, shucks. Oh, stuff keeps falling down on me. I mean, because, like, the money is good and everything like that. You can pretty much buy happiness. But I was thinking about, like, when you are, like, a celebrity like that, like, think about Justin Bieber, bro. Like, would you really want to be Justin Bieber? I mean, the cat, the cat has to be miserable, like, all the time. All right, let's check. What's good? I can check out with you? Yeah. All right, cool, here we go. Can I ask you a question, homie? What's up? Would you trade lives with Justin Bieber? Would I do what? Trade lives with Justin Bieber. Trade lives? Yeah. Like go on live with him and talk? No, no, no. Like become him. Nah. You wouldn't? Why not? Nah. I, I don't know, bro. I think I, I'm, I'm fine with my life. You know what I'm saying? Justin I Bieber, feel like he would be miserable a lot of the time. I feel like he got a good life, but at the same time, I feel you got a lot of fake love, you know? Right. Exactly. So you I can't I'd, know who you trust. I'd rather have like three real friends with real love than to have like 50,000 fake friends with fake love. <laughs> See, me and you are on the same wavelength. Yeah. All right, I'm pulling out all my you cards. You got a uh, phone number with that for a one? Yeah, it's uh, seven. It'll be 5779. That's it? All right. I'm going to have to use a bigger card. Yeah. Especially with all like the drama he's been in, bro. Right. I'm good. 
<laughs> I feel like he really can't do anything. I feel like he tried to go a little bit like ghetto or two, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Especially when he got stuck in the hood that one day when his car broke down in the hood. Oh, yeah, I saw that, I saw that. They had right. man doing push-ups and everything, singing too. <laughs> He kind of looked scared too, didn't he? Oh, he was, bro. <laughs> I remember looking at his face. He didn't even have no bodyguards with him, bro. Right? It, was just, it was just JB in the hood, bro. He, he thinks he's on a, like, I don't know. Hey, but they were showing him love, though. Right. Which is crazy, but they were. They weren't trying to rob him or nothing. You know, he had a nice car too, but it's cool, bro. I just, I don't know. That's a lot of fake stuff in that life. Bro. Yeah, probably. Like, if I was in that life, I'd have to make sure I got real people around me. You know what I'm saying? Like, or at least hang with a bunch of people that's also rich. But like, he does. He also doesn't have any like day ones. You know what I'm saying? Like Snoop Dogg got day ones. Wiz Khalifa got day ones. Well, what about this? He got his little one homeboy that was on his music videos with him back in the day. What he uh, dipped on him or something? I don't even know. Bro. Yeah. I know. I know. He used to chill with Luda back when he was like 16. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. Yeah. Was legit, you know? yeah. All right, homie. I appreciate it. I'll holler at y'all. I like your shirt. Thank you, man. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Compliment of my Naruto shirt. Let's go. All right. She is cute too. She is super cute. But as a rule of thumb, as a rule of thumb, I gotta get myself in the right angle. I'm looking at myself back on these webcams and if I'm over here, I look ugly. If I'm looking over here, I can see my bottom lip real big. So I gotta get it at the right angle. Um, but no, as a rule of thumb, I usually try not to like seriously hit on like employees, especially if they looking cute, because I feel like they probably get hit on all the time, especially if they're cute. Like if you go to a restaurant and they got a, a waitress or, or something like that, a server or whatever, and she looking cute, obviously they got her there looking cute because she looking cute, you feel me? And there's probably a gang of people that see her looking cute and is always trying to holler at her and I put myself in her position like okay yeah it's cool like the first week okay it's cool the second week third week is getting kind of old you know and then two two years later it's like the car is actually running but there's a puppy inside cute puppy too but I'm like you know what I'm saying after a while though I'm gonna wanna stop getting hit on. I'm just trying to do my eight hours and go home. You feel me? Like that's just that's, that's how I feel like it. So whenever I see like a female that was working, that's cute. The only thing I'll probably do is compliment her and be like, wow, you're looking very nice today. Um, you're having a really good hair day. Because I think people, I think people like to hear compliments more so than, hey, can I get your number? You know? And, and if you give them a compliment and then if they do respond well to the compliment and say, oh, thank you, they do the little blushing thing and they start up and they start up like a conversation or whatever like that. And then boom, that's your way in. And then if the situations are right, there's no customers come in, they're continuing to talking, you know, she's giggling and you can sort of feel the situation is going like that way, then maybe I would love to continue this conversation with you. Um, do you, do you have like somebody you're with right now? Are you talking to anybody? They say no, or they hit you with, well, I have a boyfriend right now and we're kind of in a fight. Ah, oh, well, damn. Well, if they say that, you already know. <laughs> uh, so now I'm home, I've got the mouse pad here. I'm gonna do the unboxing for that. And I'm gonna do the unboxing for the strip lights. I've never seen these strip lights before, but the people on my Discord said they're pretty easy to use. So uh, we'll see, I only bought the one. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, probably behind my setup somewhere so you can see the lights. All right, so I've got a regular kitchen knife because I don't do unboxings. So uh, I don't have an unboxing sort of knife. All right, so let's cut that open like that. Cut that open like. Oh, shucks. Okay, it's. Oh, you got it. And uh, shout out to everybody who was in the Discord uh, trying to guess this thing, uh, what it was. It was so fun asking the questions or having people ask questions and answering. All right, so I'll throw the knife to the side right here. Now, this thing is actually a lot bigger. What is this? Okay. Okay, so it's just on like a roller. Wow, this is definitely new to me. So it's by Corsair. Unravel it. 
Oh, I see. There is a... Okay, so I guess this is extended cloth gaming mouse pad. This one. There we go. All right, so yeah, this thing is actually a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. It's actually pretty freaking huge. This is definitely going to take up my desk. I probably should have waited until I can get like a smaller one. But this is this definitely takes up the entire space of my desk. Look how big this thing is compared to me. This thing is huge. All right. All right, so this is my gaming setup. You've seen it already. Um, and this is my old mouse pad. And you can see this thing is ratty. I got it with my first computer like three years. Well, my first computer, but my second computer like three years ago, four years ago. And this thing is pretty much just, it's had it. Um, so I have no idea where I'm gonna put this thing or how I'm gonna put this thing because my desk is not that big as you can see like the surface of it. Might have to move some things around before I can put it on there. All right. All right, so here it is. Now I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do to get it to lay flat like that because it kind of bumps up on the side, but this is it. And it does take up a nice sizable portion of the desk, but that's all right though. It doesn't take up as much as I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like way out here, but it's an okay size. So I'm happy with it. With the software that you download, you can change you can change the color effects so it goes rainbow wave to a color shift and this is the color shift that looks pretty dope and then you can change up the speed of the color shift i got it on the fastest setting right now <laughs> that looks actually pretty freaking cool and I guess you can also change the colors too and make it do the colors that you want. Okay, so here's the pulse on the fastest. And then this is color wave on the fastest. And this is what I spent uh, 40 bucks on for this. And then, yeah, 